Hello friends, I hope you're having a good day, morning, evening, whatever it may be. Um, my name is Blake if you didn't know and I just wanted to share this watercolor piece of me painting a street in Amsterdam in the Netherlands. Um, now there's a reason for this. I'm actually going to be studying abroad in Maastricht this coming fall, uh, T-1 month, I'm counting down, um, but Maastricht is basically on the border of Belgium and Germany. Um, so kind of a little bit farther away than Amsterdam would be. But you know, I'll be spending some time there, taking a day trip or two, so why not? Um, but other than getting my assorted legal documents out of the way, such as my residence permit, I have my passport already, um, I've literally done no prep at all. So what better way to start than by doing quote unquote research um, i.e. me painting a street in Amsterdam. Um, but overall, I'm feeling quite excited. I'm not super nervous. Um, the Netherlands is almost an entirely English-speaking country, um, so there shouldn't be too much of a language bar barrier. However, I will be taking like intro to Dutch classes, so hopefully I come away um, with a little bit of Dutch. Uh, but um, I will also have international classmates as well, um, which will help in the transition. Um, and I am fairly confident in my traveling ability. I've traveled out of the country by myself before, so I'm not too worried about that. But there are some things that I am worried about. Uh, mainly, um, I'm worried that I won't recognize this amazing opportunity while I'm there. I will, I will take for granted all of the opportunities that I have um, with this experience, and I won't utilize it to its fullest potential, whether that's traveling, whether that's eating, or whether that's just making friends. I am worried about not taking advantage of this awesome experience. I'm also worried about getting sick. Um, it's happened to me once before, and it was horrible while traveling, so hopefully that doesn't happen. Um, and I'm also worried about spending too much money. Um, I need to be on a budget, and that needs to be a strict budget. But it isn't just about um, what I'm scared or worried about. I do have some goals for this trip that I want to keep in mind as I um, progress throughout my four months abroad. Um, I want to learn some Dutch. Like I said, I was taking intro to Dutch classes. Um, so hopefully throughout that entire semester I will learn something, whether it's the basics, um, whether it's conversation skills. I hope something comes out of that experience. Um, I also want to travel to other European countries. Um, a little caveat here, it's obviously going to be on a budget. However, um, I've been told and I've looked around and Europe has an amazing rail system, so hopefully I'll be able to take some long distance trains. Um, but yeah, I want to go to a lot of different places that I haven't been yet. I also want to make new friends. Obviously, I'm not too worried about finding a friend group. I'm going with a friend. However, I don't want to be just stuck with her. I want to expand our horizons and if we have a same friend group, great. Um, I also want to make new art. Um, I go in spurts where I get really motivated and then I stop um, and I don't want these four months abroad to be one of those spurts where I'm not making art. Um, so hopefully uh, I pack a fair amount of art supplies so you know I can't take everything but I can take some stuff um, and I hopefully I'll be able to produce sketches um, of streets, of my room, of my friends, whatever um, catches my eye while I'm abroad in Maastricht. Um, I also want to not get hit by a car while riding a bike. The Netherlands is huge for their um, bike transportation systems. Um, everyone has a bike and one of my friends who came back from the same program as me last year said she got hit by a car three times while on her commute um, to classes on her bike. So hopefully that's not me. Uh, maybe I'll just stick to public transportation. Uh, depends on how confident I am once I get over there. But it is crazy to think that um, 
in one month, I will be living and learning in another country for a full four months, basically, all the way up until um, Christmas. Uh, and once I get back, I only have a year and a half of my undergraduate degree left. Um, that's just really crazy to think about how time has flown. And I'm sure this experience will fl fly by, hopefully not too fast, but I'm sure it will quickly move. Um, but yeah, I'm excited to learn, to explore, and Netherlands, I am, I am coming for you. So be prepared. As for my materials that I used in this piece, I used Windsor Newton Cold Press Professional Watercolor Paper, um, and that's 300 GSM, so nice and thick, but it's in a spiral bound sketchbook. I also just used Windsor Newton Watercolors, a couple of tubes that I had, um, as well as a travel pocket kit. Um, and then the brush I used was Princeton, um, it was a round brush in size 6, as well as Micron pens in 0.05 and 0.2 and my Uniball Signo white gel pen for some highlights. Thank you for sticking it out until the end. If you want to see the final piece and some of my other work, um, my Instagram is linked in the description below. Um, but yeah, thank you, and hopefully we'll see you again next time.